Today, I'm going to be showing you the most helpful and completely overpowered partner skills that you can unlock basically right at the start of the game. First up, we have easily one of the most useful partner skills in this video, Zephyr Glider. This skill can be used once you catch a Celeray and craft the Celeray gloves at the PAL gear workbench. This ability allows you to use the Celeray as a glider so that you don't have to craft one. Not only that, but I do believe that this glider uses stamina at a slightly slower rate than the normal glider. And another reason why using this glider is quite good is that if you're playing on normal mode, you'll drop your gear when you die, but not your Pokemon. So you'll always be able to use this glider to get back to your drop stuff. Up next, we have the ability Hard Head. This ability allows you to not only mount your rush ore once you've crafted a saddle for it, but it will also give you an ability to destroy rocks very fast and save you a lot of time gathering stone. You'll only have to be level 6 in order to unlock this one in the tech tree, making it also one of the earliest mounts that you'll be able to use. Another reason why this is one of the best abilities to use early in the game is that while riding this boar, or any mount, but this is the first one you'll be able to get, it'll negate fall damage if you fall down from very far. This makes traveling so much less treacherous early on. The next three skills are all going to be really OP skills for dishing out insane DPS. The first DPS skill I want to talk about is the Pengalit Cannon. This ability allows you to load your Pengalit into a rocket launcher and shoot it at enemies causing massive area damage. This damage will get higher as your Pengalit levels up and I'm going to go ahead and say that it's easily one of the best defenses against raids early on since you can hit all of the targets at once. You will need to craft Pengalit's rocket launcher in order to use this. The next DPS partner skill on this list is Foxbart's Huggy Fire ability. This ability can be used once you craft the Foxbark harness and it allows you to pick up the PAL in your arms and use it as a flamethrower. Not only does this just sound insane, but the ability's damage will get crazy at later levels, as well as inflicting a burn debuff for even more damage per second. This is another ability that you can get at just level 6, so it's really good for taking down harder enemies early on. And the final partner skill we're going to be going over in this video, and one of the best for damage in my opinion, is the Lift Monk Recoil, which does require you to craft the Lift Monk submachine gun at the PAL gear workbench, and once you have it, you'll be able to put Lift Monk on your head, and it'll fire its gun insanely fast whenever you're attacking something, hitting very rapidly and dishing out a ton of burst damage. 